The key to Spain's victory over Georgia was in Luis de la Fuente's game plan. He placed the central midfielders higher, playing between the lines behind the midfielders. This pinned Georgia's second line of press, making the two players on the first line unable to prevent the progression of the centre-backs and Rodri. The defence didn't find solutions throughout the first half, with Rodri breaking the press with passes to Gabi and Fabian. Even in the final third, the central midfielders were very high, playing alongside Morata, Asensio drifting inside, leaving the right wing for Carvajal and Dani Olmo giving width on the other side. Spain shot 14 times in the first half, creating chances in two ways. The first was finding Asensio and Fabian in the gap between fullback and centre-back. This is how Spain's second goal arrived, with the Georgian block deep and at the same time too wide. Spain's other strength was the aerial duels inside the box, both from set pieces and from crosses, having Spain two forwards like Morata and José Lu who are very strong in this aspect. The other key was the extraordinary level of Rodri out of possession, directing the defensive phase, being everywhere counter-pressing and giving balance in the defensive transition. The best game of Spain in 2023.